Hello, this is I, I Touch Guru, and today we are looking at the application Term VT100. This is a Mac based terminal program, and uh, I'm going to run through some simple commands that work and you could probably use to your advantage. First, we're going to be looking at the cd um, command, which means change directory. We're going to change directory to the uh, applications folder, so we're going to type cd space slash applications after you've done that click return and another pound sign should come up that basically means success okay in the applications folder we're gonna make a folder called hello okay so to make the directory you type mk D I R. This is all one word. Space hello. Click return. After this, if you want to try this, you can go into your applications folder. Um, I will browse to mine really quick. I'll show you guys. I'll And I will drag a test file named test.app right into here. So you see it right down there. Okay. I'm just going to put it there for safekeeping. And then if you look, our hello directory is right there that we just made. That's our hello directory. Okay. Now, after we made our hello directory, we are going to type, we're still in the uh, application directory, of course, we're going to type cp, which means copy, or well, copy paste actually, test.txt, that's the file I just put in there, you could use any file, test.txt space hello. That's basically saying copy and paste the file test.txt into the folder hello. After you do that, just click return. Okay, now we'll look on the computer and um, we'll refresh the page and see if it actually worked. Let me refresh it. Okay, now let's go into the hello folder. Hold on a second, I guess I have to reconnect here. That's because terminal's up. Let me get terminal down there and then reconnect. This happens sometimes, I don't know why, with terminal. <clears throat> Alright, there it goes. It's connected and we're just, I'm just going to browse to that folder that we see you do. The application's inside there. Hello folder, and there's test.txt. Okay, next we're going to uh, do a command called basically list um, settings, list info, whatever you want to call it. We're going to do it on the application. Well, we'll do sketches. Okay, so to get the info on sketches, this is what we have to do. Go into your terminal and type in ls space sketches dot app. Enter. Oh, we're not CD'd into there, so what we're going to have to do is slash again. Make sure you use the uppercase letters and everything. CD sp space slash applications. Okay, we're in that folder. And now we type ls space sketches.
dot app. Then click return. And there's all of the <clears throat> files inside of that folder. From the icon to all the buttons, everything in there. There's even a file called Vibrator. Alright. Next, we have a pretty cool application. It's actually built into the terminal called Pico. To get to Pico, you don't have to be CD to anywhere, in fact. I'll restart the application to prove it to you. Then just type in P I C O. Now, this is a writing um, app. It's been used on old Macs and uh, has all these commands here. Um, it doesn't show all of them, so I'll read them to you. It doesn't show the whole thing. The first one is get help. The second one is write out. The third one is read file. The fourth one is previous page. The next one is cut text. And then there's C-U-R-P-O-S, which I don't know what it means. Then exit, justify, where is, next page, uncut text, and then there's spell check. What to spell. Alright, and uh, you just basically type letters, or whatever, and then when you click return it says, can now justify, unjustify, which means we just went down a line and it can go back up, unjustifying. There, unjustified, and that thing went away. Alright, now we're going to go back to our uh, hello folder. We're going to just uh, CD there. Okay, we're in there. And then we're going to do a command called MV, which is going to rename the folder. So we just type MV space hello, which is the name of the folder, and we're going to rename that by. Then we click enter, and it got renamed. And now we're going to CD and to change the directory to that. So CD space slash applications slash by. Okay, now we're in there. Then we're going to delete the file test.txt, which is in that folder. You do that by doing the command rm. So rm space test.txt. That got deleted. And then we're going to change the directory back to applications. CD back into there. Now we're going to do remove directory, which is rm dir by rm dir space the folder name by. And that got deleted. And there's also um, when you're doing commands, you have the true and false, like uh, do this command true. You'll see that when you're uh, doing FTP transfers. And then there's false. They do absolutely nothing. They're just for uh, after command lines. Then there's shutdown minus R, which I haven't tried, and you guys can experiment on, but I'm not risking that. Shutdown minus R starts it, and shutdown just shuts it down. Let's uh, actually see if it does anything. You guys can try it out, but that's all for today. That's been I, I Touch Guru. I hope you enjoy this episode and learn something new and interesting. I'll see you later.